Oh, what is up, all you hungry scrimps? How's everybody doing today? I am in a parking lot right now, a very busy parking lot. So I know <laughs> comments have been made that I look around. I don't know, like, I'm just like aware of my surroundings. Maybe because, I don't know, living in a city. Listen, I went, I used to live like deep, deep in the city. So I think I'm just programmed to be like on the lookout. Um. I have Dunkin' Donuts today. We've got an iced black coffee. Um, we've also got an egg and cheese hash brown, or <laughs> an egg and cheese on a croissant and hash browns. I have not had this in so long. I used to have Dunkin' all the time um, back in college because I worked at a, um, I worked at an apartment complex and there was one basically like in the lobby. It was like right outside. Oh my God, we also had a soft serve place and the ice cream dude was so nice and he would always give me free ice cream every day. Oh my God, it was so, mm. those were the days. I was also severely depressed. <laughs> mm. Mm -mm -mm. Oh yeah. I haven't had this sandwich. I love croissant sandwiches. Never had this. Wish I had ketchup. It ain't bad though, it's not bad. Um, I usually got, I don't even think they have it anymore. I could be wrong, but it's been a while since I've had Dunkin', but I used to get the egg white veggie flatbread that was good. I mean, this sandwich really, really needs ketchup. Or like, salt, or pepper, or flavor. You know what, I think a lot of places rely on like the meat to have flavor, because this is bacon, it's supposed to be bacon, egg, and cheese, but um, I don't eat bacon. What are people, people are crazy. The drive-through, I will say, is not well designed at the Dunkin' I go to. Very populated. It is always busy, but, um, this lady was behind me trying to, I guess she was trying to go around me, but she pulled in the drive-through side. Like there was a, hard to explain, but there's a way that she could have went. She chose not to. And then she got mad at me because I wasn't moving up. She was like throwing her hands up, but I couldn't have moved up if I wanted to. Joke's on her, I didn't want to. Sometimes people on the road are just crazy. Some people don't know how to act. People, some people really just don't know like what they're, how to drive. Really. And in my, in my own self-reflection, back when um, I was in driving school, because I did, I did actually like outside of my high school, I did go to driving school. Because um, I think it like lowered our insurance or something, but this guy used to pick me up and like, he had his little brake pedal on his side. And I remember every time I was doing something wrong that he didn't like, he would always hum really loud. He'd be like, mm, and he would get nervous and he would like tap his leg. I was like, bro, like I got this. Like, it's gonna be fine. I've been doing this illegally since I was 14. Like we're fine. Um, but in retrospect of when I did my test, it wasn't that hard. And I feel like honestly, Maybe I should have failed my first, like, I, I don't think I'm a bad driver, but I think in my original test, I messed up pretty bad, and the guy was just like, it's cool, like, you're fine, get out of here, scram, kiddo, like, have, has everybody been doing that to everybody in Pennsylvania? In New Jersey, if you're from Jersey and you're watching this, I'll keep my mouth shut, no hate, but like, a lot of the times when I got a crazy driver, nine times out of 10, it's a Jersey plate. I'm not trying to bounce off stereotypes, but. 
I'm just saying. We got lots of noises going on today. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and say this is not as good as, as I hoped it would be. It's not bad. It's just like it's lacking, you know, iced coffee. I feel like it takes a lot to mess up a iced black coffee. So that was my lock jaw. I should really get that checked out, huh? I also realized I am constantly starting stories that I don't finish. Constantly. I have ADD. ADHD. ABCDE. Look, I always shove the napkins in there. I'm not mad, but I just think it's like, thank you. Love notes. There's no, there's no love note on it. America runs on Duncan. <sighs> yeah, I don't know. Let's, um, let's do a quiz, shall we? Let's do it. Come on. Um, my name is Jonathan. Hi. And I like to eat food on camera, and do BuzzFeed quizzes. So, if you'll join me, I will leave a link to this BuzzFeed quiz down in the video description. Let's go. So this quiz is, which Dunkin' Donuts summer flavor are you? Let's find out. Um, okay, what is your ideal summer day? Or, oh my god, uh, what does your ideal summer day look like? Relaxing by the pool, checking out a cute cafe, Hiking with friends or family, or staying at home and eating snacks. Well, this was clearly written before COVID. Yep, 2018. Um, my ideal summer would be like relaxing by the pool. Even though I have body dysmorphia. Um, pick the best summer treat. We have ice cream, fruit, cold lemonade, or iced coffee. I can't lie. I love fruit. A fruit that loves fruit, who would have thunk? I love, every time we go to the shore, I always get fresh fruit. It's just like, it's the vibe. It's the summer, it's the mood, you know? Choose a beach activity, surfing, tanning, reading a book or magazine, or playing volleyball. Um, I'm gonna say tanning. Um. I don't really tan, I burn, but I don't, I used to read all the time, but for the past few years, like probably for the fa past four or five years, we just bring a speaker down and like blast that, you know, sneak a little, sneak a little drinky drink on the beach, have a little, have a little time, uh, choose a summer vacation, Madrid, New York City, Amsterdam, or I'd rather stay at home. I'm gonna pick Amsterdam, let's get crazy. I feel like I've been eating a sandwich for like 25 minutes. Check the timestamp. How long have I been eating? <laughs> it's not great. It's very caloric. Damn, this really like doesn't taste like anything. Like. I'm sorry, I hate to be gross, but I'm like mushing it around in my mouth and like, my taste buds are like, where is the flavor? Anyway, last question. Pick a fun summer color. Teal, orange, red, or yellow. I'm gonna pick teal. What? All right, so my summer flavor that I am, I am butter pecan. Um. Just like this super sweet flavor, you'll love, you love the sweet things in life. Stay true to yourself and don't let the negativity in life bring you down. Um, okay. We'll go with that. Oh, I got crumbs everywhere. 
I'm a crumb crotch. Oh my lord. How did I, I need to clean my car, y'all. It is nasty. I spilled black coffee yesterday in my cup holder. My cup holder doesn't come out. I should get like a liner or something. Um, and so it is like covered in black coffee. I like tried to sop it up. Damn, you wanna get any closer to my car, Carol? Any closer to my car, Jesus. Which brings me back to, people need to learn how to drive. Hmm, okay, well, I'm gonna go grocery shopping. It looks like it's pretty crazy in there. Um, all right, I'm gonna go, I just farted. <laughs> With that being said, stay hungry.